Yo, what's up, everybody? I'm here to talk about MLB 24 The Show, and I'm just here to talk about last-minute things you haven't heard about, potentially, and if you haven't decided, this is where you get all that information just for Roach of the Show for this video. So let's get right into it. So to keep it organic, well, the first thing we can talk about is women characters being introduced to Roach of the Show. And honestly, this is a simple opinion. This is nothing but good. There's a huge W. Again, Roach of the Show, baseball itself is not particularly just male. It's also female. There is completely nothing wrong with this addition to the game. And so it's a welcome W. And if you have a problem with this, I think your like, views and values are pretty much outstanding. Like, again, I'm nowhere like progressive at all or even super conservative or super progressive. But like, I, I just don't see how you have a problem with this. This is anything but just a huge W. So let's get it right into it. Uh, basically next is basically just new defensive impact plays, but mostly for it road to the show, but also you can introduce and see them in the dare cheater moments. So let's get right into it. Uh, defensive impacts and quick time events every year. The gameplay team on MLB strives to find innovative ways to capture the essence of baseball for our fans. One area we've been eager to explore is defense and the impact it has on every game night after night. During the MLB season, we watched incredible defensive plays, and we wanted to replicate that experience in MLB The Show 24's The Road to the Show. Simple as that. And let's get right into a video. Let's just see what it looks like. Now, we have only saw a first and catcher there, but just reading the description below, this is new quick time events for every position. So we'll probably see something like in Derek Jeter's moments, you'll see a shortstop play. You might, if you play second base and you're road to the show, you'll get a second base play. I'm kind of curious what the left field and center field and right field will look like, but kind of curious. So other things that we haven't shown in these blog posts, but they've been announced on Twitter, especially this main one, is Road to the Show and Diamond Dynasty are completely two different modes. And so what that means is in the previous years, when you upgrade your Road to the Show character, you pretty much get a free diamond within uh, Diamond Dynasty. And a lot of people, me included, I hated this idea. It was it's just, it just didn't make any sense. Offline and online, except for when it comes to Diamond Dynasty in particular, should be separate. However, I do, I don't mind an idea maybe in the future as an online road to the show where you versus basically an online personality. So if you're a hitter and stuff and you're facing a road to the show pitcher, that might be an interesting combo. Just, just off the top of my head. Might be interesting to think about in the future. But for at the current moment, road to the show is completely offline and has no effect on Diamond Dynasty, pretty much the main game mode for all you online players. Next is basically they're bringing back the draft combine. So basically a couple years ago, before I believe it was 22, they removed it. 22 and 23 didn't have any draft combine. But before that, they would introduce you to like basically just a series of plays, routine grounders, routine uh, fly balls. If you play the O field, 
just routine plays where you would just go through the motions, basically just replicating what you would actually do with these draft combines, or if you play just rep baseball, pretty much just like a rep baseball tryout. And then based on your performance, and then in addition, three extra games, you'll be notified of uh, teams on a world map of who's interested. So in the first game, you go two for two. You might have like, ten, it might appear that 10 teams are interested in you. You do better on the next. Maybe you have 25 and so on, so on, so on. So it's basically one particular tryout to get the mechanics basically done for the Road to the Show players. Then three games, basically, well, it used to be international, east, central, west. But in this case, I think it's just random prospects. So next, well, I'll save the best for last, and I'll let them explain it. We have covered a lot, but one of the areas that we know our fans love to see updates on is our presentation. And the presentation team, as always, is knocking it out of the park, pun is always intended. Score bugs, broadcast styled on-field augmented reality stats, regional broadcast, and of course, the fan-beloved fan cam. And I'm very, very happy to be joined by Drew to dive into presentation. Drew, welcome. How are you? And would you please remind our fans what you do at SDS? Sure. Thanks for all the kind words, Ashley. Good to be here. Um... Yeah, my name's Drew, and I uh, am a design manager here and also the product owner of Presentation Audio and Commentary. There we go. We have a lot to talk about, so let's get right into it. With the addition of Female Road to the Show, what does minor league presentation look like and sound like this year? Yeah, we kind of just wanted to separate um, the feeling of playing in the minor leagues from the major leagues. So a couple things. We added a minor league broadcaster, uh, Ben Gelman. It was just terrific. So that's exciting. Um, I think it'll really differentiate that mode. But we also just wanted to make that whole experience feel like you're in the minor league. So we have a new minor league presentation package as well. You know, we wanted to still give you all the information you need, but kind of make it feel authentic to that experience. Those were the two big things. And then you mentioned the female road to the show player. Can't be overstated uh, how much work went into creating all the lines from commentary that were needed to support that. Um, so that was a ma major undertaking this year. A labor of love, but an incredible project. And as yep, so basically, just a brief summary and i'll stop it right there so just don't spoil it for anybody who's not interested in watching the rest i would uh, probably just link down the link to this live stream down below but basically new double a presentation and specific lines and stuff for males and females because again like if you're the first female in major league baseball and the road to the show your aspect of the media representation is going to be a lot different in compared to if you're a male. So basically, I think there's a huge W. It gives people incentive, even if you're a guy, to actually try a female, uh, maybe a try a female character to go uh, explore and explore the story mode. I think nothing but doubt this is just a huge dub and there's literally nothing like a red flag to do anything about this. So that's it, everybody. I'm super excited. This is pretty much a last minute video. I wanted to release this video pretty much at five o'clock of today. In a couple hours, we'll be getting a touch on on MLB 24 the show. And comment down below, uh, what position are you gonna make your road to the show character? I'm kind of curious. If you're interested in also seeing maybe some a different perspective of the Diamond Dynasty play right off the bat, I am gonna be posting a Diamond Dynasty video just one hour from now. Basically, just the new updates of Diamond Dynasty. And for all you newcomers out there, I'll see you on the field. And don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. And I'll see you at 12 o'clock if you want to hit the live stream. I will be streaming this at 12 as soon as this game release. So in the meantime, hope everybody has a good night. And I'll see you later tonight.